Cutting through the dark, one of hundreds of meteors peppering our skies. Here in Porton Cross in Scotland, to this one caught on camera in Hemel Hempstead. They were spotted by stargazers across the UK. In Kenley near Croydon, they sat patiently watching, hoping to see one. I think everybody's basically interested in astronomy. Um, people that come here that are brand new always love to have a look through the telescope and see things like Saturn and Jupiter. I think everybody's got a fundamental interest in what's, what's up there. The phenomenon happens once a year when the Earth's orbit around the Sun reaches a certain point. It always occurs between mid-July and late August. The Earth spins through the cosmic dust left from the tail of a comet Swift Tuttle, which passed through in 1992. The particles collide with our upper atmosphere at speeds of 36 miles per second. And on hitting the atmosphere, they vaporise into flashes of light, which is what we can see down on the ground. Oh, it's a good opportunity to, to, to see lots of meteorites, especially this year as it's, there's no moon and it's a nice clear sky. So easily you could blink and miss it, so some hedge their bets with telescopes while others carefully scan the sky. The brighter the meteor, the rarer it is, but for every one we manage to spot coming through our atmosphere, there are several others which are too dull for us to see. With experts predicting up to a hundred of these could enter our atmosphere every hour, for some lucky stargazers, space may have put on quite a show. Siobhan Robbins, Sky News.